So one of the best ways to dollar cost average your investments is by setting up a recurring buy. It basically means you would buy a certain amount of cryptos at regular intervals and at different price points. And when you buy a crypto at different price points, you kind of average out the price you're going to pay for the asset and reduce the overall risk involved in investing. But how can you do that? Well, let's find out. Hi there, my name is Tej and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can use the platform known as Crypto.com to set up recurring buy. Please don't forget to hit the like, comment and subscribe to stay notified about all of the cryptocurrency videos we are going to upload on this channel. So let me jump into my screen and show you a quick tutorial. Alright, so the first thing that you have to do is log into your Crypto.com app and next you're going to click the blue circle on the bottom and next you're going to click recurring buy. When you do that, you're going to come to this page and then you have to click the blue button on the bottom that says set up recurring buy. Then it's going to ask you to select the cryptocurrency of your choice. So let's say for this example, we want to set up a recurring buy for Ripple. So we're going to click that. Then you're going to come to this page where you have to enter the dollar amount of Ripple that you want to set up for a recurring buy. So let's say we want to buy 100 Canadian dollars of Ripple on a particular day of the week. So I'm just going to put 100 Canadian dollars. Next, you're going to select the frequency. So we have weekly, bi-weekly, monthly, right? So for example, I want to set up a monthly recurring buy. Next, it's going to ask you to repeat on either first day of the month last day of the month or the specific day of the month so for example for this video i want to set it up probably on a specific day of the month probably like a second sunday so i'm going to click second and sunday once i do that i'm going to confirm it if everything looks good once you have done that the next step would be to select your means of payment uh, you can set it up using three ways so we have credit card crypto wallet and fiat wallet so in my opinion fiat wallet is the most cheapest and most convenient way to kind of pay for your crypto credit card is really really expensive because they charge you approximately 3.5 percent on every transaction so ensure that you have money in your fiat wallet um, every month so that you can process a transaction in the easiest way and also in the cheapest way and yeah once you are done with that all you have to do is confirm the schedule also the maximum number of recurring purchases you can have uh, per month is five per user so you cannot set more than five uh, purchases in a month so when you click confirm schedule you're going to come to this page where you can check the amount uh, the pay with option frequency repeat on first transaction date so our first transaction date would be on 14th of november 2021 um, if everything looks good all you have to do is just go through their terms and conditions on the bottom uh, so it's going to tell you that a pending transaction will be created upon the schedule is created and it will be uh, executed by the end of the day in your local time and also one more thing I do want to mention is that you can cancel this uh, schedule before the upcoming purchase absolutely for free of cost. However, if the initial purchase of your schedule is happening on the same day, like if this transaction is happening today, we will be charged the initial purchase immediately once we confirm it. So if it looks good, just click confirm. Next, you have to enter your passcode and there you go. That's pretty much it. You'll receive a confirmation saying that you'll be purchasing 100 Canadian dollars worth of XRP coins on every second Sunday of the month. You'll also receive an email uh, outlining the confirmation of the same. So you can see that we have scheduled uh, the purchase on every second Sunday of every month for 100 Canadian dollars of Ripple. And the first purchase is going to start uh, by 14th November 2021. And all the purchases and all the transactions that do take place will appear under this section. Now let's say you have schedule this purchase and for some reason you would like to cancel it so you're going to click the three dot button on the top and when you do that you're going to see something that says cancel schedule click that and that's it the schedule is cancelled so that's essentially how you set up a recurring buy and also how you cancel it using crypto.com it's an easy way to invest in long term because you are averaging out the total price you're paying for a single asset and hence reducing the overall risk if you would like to watch a detailed video where i explain you everything you need to know about dollar cost averaging then please click the link mentioned in the description box below that's all for now thank you so much for watching i hope you guys really enjoyed that video and found it helpful if you did don't forget to use the referral link i have mentioned in the description box below if you're new to crypto.com if you use that link you're gonna make some money so will i uh, again thank you so much please don't forget to hit the like comment and subscribe and i shall see you guys in my next one till then take care bye